Sagittarius, this is your reading for February 2021. So let's get started and see what's going on for you this month. What does Sagittarius need to know about February, please? Okay, Sagittarius, so out here first we have it's okay to have a voice and speak your truth, but that came out reversed. So for some reason right now you are feeling like it's not safe to speak your truth. What else can you tell Sagittarius about this please? So knowledge and learning empower you. So maybe you feel like you don't know enough about a certain subject to be able to speak out about it. So let's get some other cards and see what clarity we can find out for you about this. Can you please tell Sagittarius what this has to do with in their life, please? In February. Well, how did that happen? Okay. So we have the Emperor Penguin here, and it says small steps lead to profound metamorphosis. So perhaps at this time, Sagittarius, you're just kind of being a little bit hard on yourself, feeling like you should be further along with something or more knowledgeable about something than you feel like you are right now before you put yourself out there or start speaking out about this. So let's get some more cards and see what else we can get here. Can you please clarify the knowledge and learning empower you? Thank you. Okay, so you could be juggling something right now. Um, maybe you're like going to school and doing work at the same time, or you just feel like maybe you don't have enough time um, and effort to put into like your creative idea because maybe you have some kind of other responsibilities to take care of. Can you please clarify the Two of Pentacles? Clarify, thank you. So then we have the Two of Swords. Okay, so you're trying to balance something and you don't really want to let go of one thing, but it seems like you're being faced with the um, decision to kind of have to let something go. So with the Two of Swords here, it seems like you just are trying not to see that there's a decision here at all, like you just don't want to make up your mind. So what is this thing? Okay, so we have the Ace of Cups then here as when I was asking to clarify like what this thing is that you don't want to make a decision about. Okay, so I mean it's a big deal to you, like it's something that you really love. Please clarify this, clarify the Ace of Cups, thank you. So we have the Hanged Man here in reverse. So it's going to require looking at something differently. And this actually, you know, I was trying to clarify the Ace of Cups, but it came out over here with the Two of Pentacles and Two of Swords. So for you to make this decision to move forward, it looks like there needs to be a change of perspective, I think, on your part, Sagittarius. Can you please clarify this for Sagittarius? So we have the Knight of Cups here in reverse that came out with the Ace of Cups. So you're wanting to manifest some kind of love offer or um, you're just feeling like something's moving too slowly with coming together with another person. And then we have the Seven of Cups, which was upright. So if, you, if this is a love situation for you, um, it seems like this other person in your situation also has like a lot of choices and options and decisions to make and right now they're kind of just like weighing them all out you know and some of these things are illusions like not all of these seven cups are uh, really gonna pay off for this person they might not be true options for him or her um, so then we have the lovers up right here and then we have the high priestess which is reversed so 
your intuition seems like it could be a little off for some reason, Sagittarius. Like this slow movement process, I think, is kind of freaking you out a little bit. You know, like uh, I think that you are really wanting to know more about this person's process of uh, choosing to be in a relationship with you or not. Uh, maybe they are currently with someone else, but I mean, they might be single too, like, and just not know if they want to settle down or commit. So I think this is you kind of like in your head over here, like, oh, it's taking so long and we're only getting slow movement towards some kind of love relationship because they must have someone else. They're juggling me and someone else or maybe several people and you think that that's like what's stopping this person from just like full-blown getting into a relationship with you right now or maybe they're not giving you as much of attention as they once were or you think they should be right now. So anyway, I don't think it's really like that big of a deal actually on the other person's part. Like, yeah, I think they're thinking about being in a relationship and, but they aren't coming in with the offer because they're still thinking about things like the, and like I said, some of these, uh, you know, cups in the seven of cups are, are not real. So they might just be like, do I really want to settle down because whatever, you know? And I mean, that's fair for somebody else to, um, to be thinking about those things. But ultimately, like, I think that they are thinking about this all just because they want to make a good decision about being in a relationship with you. And so that's where I think that, you know, your intuition could be kind of just really making you more anxious and worried about this. You know, like you think it's kind of one way, but I don't think it really is that way. I don't think they're like out there, you know, like dating a bunch of people. Like they're just thinking about like, do I want to date a bunch of people at some point? Because if I get in a relationship, I can't. And I really think that's all it is. So I think that's where your change of perception can come in here, Sagittarius. Just like give them their time and not think the worst and not, um, yeah, just like hold yourself back from speaking your truth to this person. I think it's okay to do that. I, I like maybe it holds you back because you think there's somebody else, you know, and they're just going to be like, oh, that's too much for me to deal with. I'm just going to go be with this person. Like, I think it's okay to speak your truth about what you want with this person. And I hope that this is just the knowledge that you needed to gain that, you know, there's really isn't a lot going on over there. He's just thinking. That's all. So that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. I hope this eased your mind a little bit. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you um, would like, you can subscribe and see more videos like this. If you'd like a personal reading, my information is in the description box below, and I'll talk to you again soon. Thanks.